guys constructive criticism is so good for you but being told to being told that you can do better is just kind of like oh do you know what i mean like i dish like i that do you want the bit put it to touch slow and fast just give it to me give me to me watch uh never on board that would become a photo uh what a dog back to my youtube what is it hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here thank you so much for joining if you're new here my name is yamara yamara choto keep up with the vibes if you're new here thank you so much for joining us today i hope that you like today's video and i hope that you stay if you're a returning subscriber one watches my videos on a regular thank you so much for coming back today i really hope that you like today's video and guys say it with me i hope that you brought a friend today's friday the 22nd of march and i am starting a weekend vlog for you guys weekend starts on a friday okay we vibe over here really really don't like this light guys but then now if i do this i just think that it's too dark i think i like this better i don't know so today is friday and as you guys know we have classes on friday so i thought you know what why not start a weekend vlog just to show them what your weekend is all about and what i get up to during the weekend so yeah i had a really slow morning today not by choice to be fair but my sleep schedule is a bit fucked up if i can use that word for some reason now i can't sleep anytime before 1 a.m unless like exhausted and i mean by exhausted i mean i can't even lift a finger that's the only way that i'll sleep before 1 a.m and that bothers me so much because during the week right monday to thursdays at least i try to wake up between 7 and 8 and if i sleep at 1 i'm only getting 6 to 7 hours of sleep and for me that's not enough imagine if i was sleeping at 11 and waking up at 7 30 that would literally be eight hours if i'm not mistaken if my math is correct it's about eight hours it's fine with me but because i can't fall asleep before because it's so frustrating and now well i know what's causing it is because i'm taking naps in the afternoon but also the reason why i'm taking naps in the afternoon is because i'm not getting enough sleep during the night so then now i just get really tired easily during the day and it's just it's a constant cycle that i'm trying to break but i just don't know how to do it so i'm going to try to either stop taking naps during the day or take the nap for a shorter time maybe like 30 minutes um nap or something because my sleep is just getting so fucked up and i don't like that i woke up with eye bags today guys and i literally yesterday i think i slept at two between two and three a.m and today i was up by 8 30. 
I never get eye bags guys it's rare for me to have eye bags but anyways we're having brunch because now it is 11 49 and we're having a little brunch type thing as I absolutely love making sandwiches like that's like my go-to now I'm also having cream soda this juice is goated onto the day well quite a number of things that i need to do today first of all i need to go to the library because i need to work on an assignment that is due on sunday on thursday yesterday in class i got some feedback on the work that i'd done for that assignment I don't know when, did I start on Monday? I don't know, but I started it sometime. And I just wanted feedback on the stuff that I've done so far. And guys, there's nothing, there's nothing harder to accept than constructive criticism. Like, it's so easy to say, you know what, guys, constructive criticism is so good for you. But being told to, being told that you can do better, is just kind of like, oh, do you know what I mean? Like, it kind of hurts. Do you know what I mean? And at the same time, I'm grateful that I got constructive criticism or, like, I got constructive feedback from my lecturer because then at least now when I'm actually submitting my assignment, I'm doing what I was told to do. So that's the good thing also about starting your assignments earlier and asking questions and stuff like that is that you actually do end up getting guidance on what you have done so far. So I'm not going to lie. Yesterday after class, I was feeling a bit... Mm, because i was just like, like i really thought i was going down the right path but he basically said you need more and i said okay <laughs> but anyway so yeah i'm gonna be working on that today because i want to get 90 percent of it done today and then tomorrow which is saturday i'll just do the final touches and hopefully i'll submit it by sunday morning because it's due on sunday to 11 59 p.m but i just don't want it in the back of my head and then also today after the library i need to come back and i need to film for white fox i got a new package from them because there's a new collection that's dropping on wednesday and they want me to film for that new collection so it was really quick and like really the turnaround time is very yeah so i need to film that as well and then what else do I need to do today? I need to upload a video. I edited a video yesterday after class. So after that whole class thing, I came back. I took a nap because I was like, yeah, no, I cannot deal with this right now. And that's the nap that fucked up my sleep. Anyways, I um, took a nap and then I edited a video, my Q&A video, which is now live. So if you haven't watched that, please do go and watch that. So I need to upload that video today. And then I need to post a reel that I finished editing. And it has been approved for it to go live. So that's what I have on for today. I'm really hoping that I can get all of it done. Today feels like a productive day, okay? I cleaned my bathroom, guys. Anyways, I'm going to finish eating and then we'll go to the library together and get some work done. Oh my gosh, guys, I was watching... I don't know, probably my South African subscribers would be familiar with that or even like just my subscribers in general but dr andy she's a med student she's in i think she's at uct i think or she's in cape town like i was watching her tiktok and she was basically talking about how she was trying to get out of a mental slump and how no one talks about how hard uni is regardless of your degree regardless of what you're studying in uni you're expected to show up every single day oh Gosh, guys, I've never related to a video so much in my life. These are supposed to be the best years of our lives. These are supposed to be the years that we discover ourselves, that we make friends, that we go out. But where's the time coming from if I have deadlines that I need to meet every other week? It's actually insane. But um, And then I was going through the comments and then someone was saying that uni is literally made up of 50% of good days and 50% of bad days. And when you really put that into perspective, that is a lot of bad days, guys. I feel like the ratio is supposed to be like maybe 80-20, but then the reality of it is that it's actually 50-50. You're still expected to show up and show out on your bad days. It's hard. But anyways, I'm going off on a little bit of a rant now. But you know what? The important thing is for us to then pick ourselves up, you know, keep going, keep pushing. And just remember, like, why you started and where you want to go with all of this. If there's anyone who needs motivation out there, I would really, really highly recommend you to go watch that TikTok. It's so motivational for me. And I was like, you know what, guys? At the end of the day, I feel like we're all struggling. But all of us are also just doing our best to deliver. And... To do well if you're struggling you're not alone a lot of us out here are struggling but we're just pushing it we're gonna keep going okay the end goal guys is to walk across that stage wake up mr west mr west mm, double d mm, d mm, mm, cap. 
Anyways, I'll catch you guys in the library. I was really just about to say you know what i'll wake up and i'll film tomorrow but then i realized that the whole reason behind me filming today is because if i film over the weekend like on saturday or sunday or whatever i'll feel like i spent most of my time in front of the camera just filming and that's how i felt last week because then i filmed on it's actually this week because i filmed on monday then i ended up feeling as if like i wasted a whole day um off of that that's why i wanted to do some studying first and then film after that so yeah about to put on a wig and i am exhausted my head oh my gosh but anyways i got so much work done i'm so happy i'm, sure I'm gonna finish it either tonight or the assignment by the way or i'll finish it tomorrow morning let me actually install this wig really really quickly and film the white fox stuff that I need to film. Ah, oh, this makes me so happy. I actually don't need to blow it down. It's giving um, blue this vibes. Anyways, let me put on my makeup though. My makeup, I definitely have to put it on. I can't get away with that one. sit like this to do and a tracksuit and what else? two other things I think <laughs> Yeah. 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 
should probably pull out my ring light for better lighting but you know what ain't nobody's got time for that okay no one has time to be doing that that's a lot of work that i'm not willing to do so hi guys this should work out almost perfectly actually i'm about to go to the mall for two reasons actually i've been working on my assignment from my room and i refuse to spend the whole of my saturday in a room doing assignments no ways i'm sorry the second reason is tissue i need to buy granola because i'm out of the one that i bought so of yogurt i'll check before i leave and i also need to buy little containers for my rice my pasta and my granola i need a barbecue sauce for my lamb because i want to make lamb chops probably tomorrow or like this coming week i've been looking at my bed for weeks now and i'm just like something is missing like it's too not that it's too simple but it could use more stuff do you get what i might be going to get a frame for the top of my bed like on the wall remember when i was complaining that the person was in here before me was sticking stuff on the wall yeah i'm i'm going to be that person i don't think i'm getting it today i'm probably getting it next week or something i don't like spending too much money in one day because i feel like that's wasteful because like if i want to buy something i'm gonna have to think about it before i buy it because am i just wasting money or do i actually need it type of thing outfit of the day is this white fox tracksuit guys it's actually getting really cold this is from the newest collection and i just have it on with my new balance um shoes i've just been working on my assignment i'm actually almost done like i just have like this much left it's due tomorrow at 8 pm start your assignments early you will be okay okay right now if this was me in first year i'll be so stressed because i'm like oh my gosh I this 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 start your assignments early go to your lecturers ask for feedback that will help you in the long run if i get less than a distinction i don't know if i'm reaching but yeah now nah, if i get less than a distinction for this assignment i don't know where i went wrong what else do I want to say? Also, my cycle started today. I woke up feeling so happy, guys. Like, I was dancing. After the shower, I was dancing and everything. Only for my cycle to start at the end of the day. It literally started maybe like an hour ago. And again, that also explains why my face has been breaking out so much. It's actually insane. My battery is about to run out. I will vlog the more for you guys just to show you guys what I'm going to be up to. But let me show you guys my full fit in the mirror. So cute. Like, guys, this tracksuit is so comfy. And then as I said, I'm going to get my New Balance shoes. I need to buy a new pair of New Balance and a new pair of uh, new pair of Air Force Ones because I really, really need new shoes in my yeah. Shop White Fox and use my discount code Yimurayi U W F. I'm going to start putting my White Fox um, discount codes in my videos because why not? I am back home. I'm not gonna show you guys what I got because obviously you guys already saw. I'm burning. Fuck. Hi, bo. Oh. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wash these and then I'm going to allow them to air dry overnight. I want to show you guys what I got from Hungry Jacks, right? So I don't wanna order. I don't want to get something big like a big meal because i have pasta that i can eat tonight i was just like you know i just want a little snack since i'm already here 
so i got these these are called burger bites they're like the newest whatever right and i've been seeing them all over my tiktok i've already had some of them so basically what it is right is that it looks like you know like a chicken nugget type thing but it's a burger bite so it has everything that a burger has so it has the meat and i can taste cheese as well i don't know how to feel about it because like it it tastes like something that i would give baby milan and onion i think yeah this definitely has cheese they don't taste bad but i wouldn't buy them again anyway they're only five dollars for 20 of them so i guess that's fine oh my gosh guys i was watching tanaka paula's vlog he's a zim youtuber she's in uni as well when they were celebrating their two-year anniversary and i was just like love is a beautiful thing guys i was smiling the whole time tanaka i don't know if you're watching this vlog but if you are i was literally just watching the, you know what let me actually text her right now she going to text her and be like girl why why was i smiling throughout and i was why was i smiling when i was watching your vlog just text her she's gonna laugh at me
saying i actually don't even know why they're so bad 3 28 pm i'm having such a slow day oh my gosh but now i wanted to do my laundry but then there's so many people like everyone decided that you know what today is a sunday i want to do my laundry today so i have more school work that i need to do not that i need to do it but it would be nice if i got some more work done so i might do that actually no i'm gonna watch something for a bit until my cramps are gone and then i'm gonna do some school work Crazy like that. Oh, I'm gonna try to leave. 